For nearly seven decades, researchers and students from Brazil's National Institute for the Research of the Amazon, INPA, have been collecting specimens from the jungle fauna. There are millions of invertebrates of all kinds, sizes, shapes, colors and environmental functions in the Institute's collection, most of which have never been properly classified. Over the last few months, biologists led by Professor Marcio Oliveira have been making a concentrated effort to address the backlog, and they've made important discoveries along the way. Nearly 100 new species, mostly wasps and ants, have been identified. A zoological collection can be described as a library of nature. Here, we keep the organisms that our students and researchers collect, identify what these species are and study their role in nature. And then, we can try and use the functions performed by these organisms to benefit the humanity. There is an enormous wealth of biodiversity in the collection of the National Institute for the Research of the Amazon, but there is still much more to be discovered in the jungle. And researchers say that as the forest gets destroyed, there is a risk that many species are being lost even before they have been described by scientists. CGTN came with a team of researchers on a field mission to witness their work using different strategies and various traps to collect insects, like this net used to capture those flying closer to the ground. Or this trap placed high up in the trees to catch a species that live in the canopies, an environment that remains largely unknown to scientists compared to ground level. There are also traps that use light to attract bugs active at night, like this one, an illuminated blanket. The collecting here went very fast. I woke up and went to check the illuminated blanket and picked some specimens that attracted my attention. In 15 minutes, we picked four different orders of insects, split into seven families, and I've registered at least 12 different species. As species of scorpions da Amazônia, ainda, apesar de ter alguns estudos, ainda falta muito estudo. There's still a lot left to study about the different species of scorpions of the Amazon. This one that I'm holding here could be carrying enormous biotechnological potential. The poison of this animal could be studied and could eventually make its way into some application in medicine and or any other field that could benefit society. A whole body of research devoted to the tiniest lives in the rainforest that hold huge potential for mankind. Paulo Cabral, CGTN, Iranduba and Manaus, Brazil.